I wanted to give you guys another example of what healthy and real life looks like. And sometimes what maintaining and creating a consistent healthy lifestyle. And like I've shared before, I lost about 35 pounds and I've kept it off for a number of years. And now I help other people do the same. And I was doing something the other day and just kind of laughing and thinking how my sister came to mind and her voice saying, you're crazy for doing that. And it just got me thinking that sometimes we think that like it's going to be so convenient and so easy and to do these things. And when it's not, we feel like there's a problem to maintain a healthy lifestyle is truly what I'm talking about, or really reach, reach and maintain any goal or, um, you know, consistent habits. So what, what the situation was the other day is I had lab work done in the morning, um, early and I, it had to be fasted. So usually I do my workout and I like, can't wait to have my smoothie when I'm, when I'm done. But the other day I couldn't have my smoothie because I had to go in for my lab work. So what I did is I literally made my smoothie and then I was going somewhere right after that. So I wasn't going to have time to have breakfast or like go home or anything like that. So what I did is I made my smoothie, I put it in a cooler bag with a couple ice packs, and I brought it with me to have when I was done with my lab work. And I could have done a lot of other things. I could have driven all the way back home. I didn't really have time. I could have gone through a drive through I could have went to the grocery store. Um, I could have just had anything I really wanted to and told myself, well, what, it was, what was I supposed to do? I wasn't home. I had to get lab work done. I just had a lot of blood work done. I can eat whatever I want. I could have done all of those things. But I didn't because I thought about it beforehand. I planned a little bit. It didn't even take me really really any extra time because I make the smoothie anyways. And I'm giving this exa example just to show you guys, one, what healthy in real life actually sometimes looks like, and two, that it's not always going to be convenient and easy and rainbows and daisies. Sometimes we are going to have to put in a little bit of that extra work. And you know what? When I was done, I was thrilled that I had it, thrilled that I did it, didn't have to spend any extra money than the money that I'd, I had already spent to buy the groceries. So just a little example of what consistent, healthy, real life sometimes looks like.